Scorpio, welcome back to Angels Light Tarot. Thank you, thank you, thank you for stopping by for your weekly general message for August the 10th through August the 16th. And of course, Scorpio, we're going to start with your love bird bonus. For those of you who are in a beautiful, 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 mm-hmm, <laughs> romantic romantic relationship wowzy wowzy yes we have love isn't that beautiful wishing well to make some wish ma to make some wish magic cast the spell throw pennies into a wishing well you guys that are in a beautiful loving relationship what do you need to wish for you already have exactly what you want and that is true love yes 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 so let's look into the yes 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 maybe you're wishing that you can have more love is that possible i don't know scorpio hmm check your your the playlist for your monthly love message okay now for you single scorpions what is going on what's the love energy around you for this week we have shivery and lead the way i definitely feel like someone is challenging you yes someone is showing you love and they're trying to see will you catch on that they're showing you love will you catch on that that little that little wink that they really really like you let's see let's see scorpio if you catch that wink if you catch that nod <laughs> yes all right so let's get into your general message for seven little days angels and guides positive energy positive energy for scorpio angels we're looking for some positive messages yes we are for scorpio hmm scorpio what's going on here thank you thank you thank you one more please angels one more yes wow i'm just gonna say wow you're like dora wow what i'm almost done not really just began but you guys know that you can take that little button yeah you can take that little button and move it and move it and move it to the side okay angels positive energy positive energy for scorpio for the month for the month for the week of august the 10th through august the 6th yes 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 moving on to the angels of light deck angel thank you i really appreciate that angels moving on come on angels what's going on what is i feel yes 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 and yes there we go angels what is going on for scorpio one more angels deck yes 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 you're like Dora, no more angels <laughs> I'm gonna get there, I promise, I promise. Okay, angels, positive energy. Let's see if we can move along quickly for, yes, for lovely, lovely Scorpio. Moving on to the new deck, and I feel like this will be the last deck. Yes, thank you until until we top it off with the hummingbird deck as usual yes yes and yes positive energy positive energy for scorpio mm -hmm. and now ready okay let's get right into your messages angels and guides we're looking for positive energy yes are we ready are we ready we ha 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 major theme for the week is the world card and you know what that is the world card with the ace of clubs the six of clubs the angel of listening oh my gosh peace oh the tower the tower seven of hearts and the four of clubs you know the world card i feel like something i'm picking up some you're about to you know what there's an idea that you're coming up this week that's going to set you on a different 
path. There is an idea that you're coming up with that is going to be presented with the world. With the Six of Clubs, I know you won't be able to shake it. Once that idea pops up in your head, that light bulb goes off. Yeah, you're like, um, this is a brilliant idea. The world needs this idea. Yes, with the angel of listening, I hear you listening to your angels. I definitely, like, with the peace, you're like, shh. I'm listening to my angels. I'm listening to my angels. I feel like with the tower moment, it's going to be earth shattering this idea that you come up with. Now, not everybody with the seven of hearts is going to agree with your new idea. Not everybody is going to be, oh, that's so wonderful. No, there's going to be some naysayers, but you keep with the four clubs. You keep moving forward. You keep with that idea because it's a gift. It's a gift from, you know, the angels. Now, it wasn't gift. It wasn't a gift for that person, that person, that, that this gift is for you. So whatever this brilliant idea is that, that you get for the world, use it. It might be maybe not for the world, maybe for your home or maybe for your community or maybe for your city, maybe for your state, but it's definitely earth shattering. Okay. All right. Now, when we look at your recent past we have the page of wands reversed with the queen of diamonds the ten of spades yes 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 the angel of repose spread your wings the angel the ace of feathers yes 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 and the jack of diamonds and the queen of diamonds so in the recent past i definitely see with the page of wands you had been wanting to do something but you didn't necessarily go in that direction that you wanted to maybe it was too much money maybe it was just a little bit more than what you were willing to spend and maybe it, it was just too much work maybe literally it was just too much work so with the angel of repose you kind of like okay i'm just gonna forget about it with the spread your wings i definitely feel like you felt like you should have done that whatever that thing is that you wanted to do you felt like god why didn't i do that you definitely i feel like you came to terms with, okay, maybe this is something that I need to do. And it looks like something very, very creative. And with the queen of diamonds, I see that you're like, you know what? I'm, this is agitating me that I'm not doing this. This is agitating me. So I feel like in the recent past, it, it was kind of like, why didn't I do that? I hear you saying, why didn't I do that? Right now let's look into the middle of the week. We have the Queen of Cups reverse with the Seven of Hearts, the Seven of Spades, another Seven of Hearts, with the Angel of Reflection, teaching and learning, the Strength card, the Two of Hearts, and the Jack of Clubs. So I'm, I'm feeling like emotionally speaking, you're feeling like, you know what, I cannot be emotional when it comes to this. I, I just I just can't. I just have to detach emotionally. I have to have faith. I have to um because I feel like I feel like in the past you went you 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 acted through emotions, right? In the past you acted through emotions and now you're like, no, I can't act through emotions. I have to act through, I need to move forward with the teaching and learning. There's something here that you are wanting to do. You're, and I feel like, I, I see that you're like getting more information of maybe reading um, how to's and, and things of that nature. I feel like you have the strength to do this with the two of hearts. You might even do this with someone that you love, maybe a partner, maybe a partner that is very dear to you and maybe even with the jack of clubs, maybe this partner is very creative. They might even be a little bit younger than you, but whatever this is that you are working on, you are not using any type of emotion. This is like, you know, I gotta kind of put my emotions to the side and I have to move forward and I have to have faith and I have to have faith that I'm not gonna be emotional about this. So. Whatever this is, I feel like you're going to be doing it with someone else. You're sharing the responsibility, okay? Now, when we move to the end of the week, we have the Queen of Swords reversed with the Seven of Diamonds, the Queen of Clubs, the Angel of Health, all is well. Four of acorns, yes, 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 three of clubs, and the Seven of Clubs. So by the end of the week, I see that, you know, yes, 
Yes, you definitely, um, you definitely had go been going through the week being uh, and like kind of sharp, kind of like, you know, I just have to do this, 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 right? But I see you getting a little bit softer by the end of the week. I see you being more detached when it comes to resources. I see you, you're, but at the same time, I, I see you're like, I see you do, I have to do this, I have to do this, and I have to do this. Yeah, I have, to, I have to do all of this. And I feel like the angel of health, this might have something to do with health. Uh, maybe, um, yeah, maybe it has something to do with health. But, you know, I feel like it could be your, it could be your workout routine. It could be you're eating differently, or I feel like, yeah, I'm definitely picking up that whatever this is, you're going to be fine because you're taking good care of yourself or someone, or you're taking good care of someone else with the four of, of acorns. I feel like, I feel like you're being very supportive and very loving. With the three of clubs, you're still a little bit worried. You're still a little bit worried and a little bit, okay, more worried than than, than you should be. But with the three of clubs, let that worry go. I feel like, this is like, you may be worried about money and it's causing issues with your health, but let it go. All is well. You are going to be comfortable. You are going to be um, stable, but I still see a lot of worry. And remember, if you are worried, you're going to create more things in your life to be worried about, right? So if you're so worried about something, maybe you're worried about health. Okay, if you're worried about health, do something different. Uh, maybe go for a jog. Maybe... Um, uh, what, lift weights, whatever it is, whatever you are worried about, change your diet, change, maybe become a vegan, maybe become a vegetarian or, or whatever it is that you need to create something different for your health. But I definitely feel like if you let go of that worry, everything is absolutely going to be a-okay, right? Okay, that's by the end of the week. And it seems totally different from the middle of the week definitely feels so, totally different but whatever it is i feel like i feel like whatever you're attaching this this energy to where you're being emotional less in the middle of the week and you're you're letting go i feel like i feel like you're doing a lot of thinking a lot of thinking it's almost like you're in your head and you're letting go of the emotions it's like you're cutting through a lot of your emotions and you're getting right to the core of the situation. And it looks like you're talking to someone, you're, you're close to someone, and, and whatever this is, you're doing it together with someone, okay? Now, let's, let's look into your bonus. Now, we have the Page of Pentacles, the Three, the Three of Cups, mm -hmm, the Nine of Clubs, the Ten of Diamonds, the Angel of Detachment, mm -hmm, Heaven, Hello from heaven, yes, yes, yes. Seven of acorns, four of spades, and five of clubs. So your bonus is telling me, yes, there is new money coming. Maybe not a lot, but enough, right, right? And you are ready to celebrate, how about that? With the nine of clubs, I hear you talking about all this abundance that is around you. You are definitely with the angel of detachment. You are detached. I feel like you're detached from worry. With the eight, the hello from heaven, this is definitely a gift from your ancestors, from your angels. You are definitely determined to have security in your life and you are not changing your mind about it. So wherever this new money is coming from, you are definitely feeling good about it. So if you're having health issues this week, yeah, this money is going to make you feel just a little bit better, okay? So I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.